Hey, I wanted to say thanks for your series on healthy eating. I found the parts about the coconut oil to be really interesting. I wanted to show you here, uh, this is my stevia plant. And I've been growing this for about seven years now. Um, I bought a packet of seeds from Seeds of Change and uh, it contained 14 seeds only. And out of those, only three or four of them germinated. One of them grew to full size. This one here. And I am in zone six, even though this is a zone 11 plant, which means it should grow in Hawaii, but it should not be growing in Tennessee, which is where I am. Uh, but what I do is I bring it inside during the winter in this, in this thing. So you gotta pot it in something that's transportable. And I have pulled it out once and, and uh, put some new uh, soil mixture underneath it to keep it growing when it started to get kind of kind of icky. Um, during the season it'll have uh, the leaves will kind of dry up there and you um, I collect them and then I also collect the dried ones during the uh, the winter as they come off and uh, after saving them up for about five years worth um, in plastic bags I cleaned out this <coughs> coffee grinder really well, completely, got rid of all the coffee, I totally cleaned it, pick and span, and uh, ground up the stevia in that. And that whole thing, uh, five years worth of stevia leaves from this plant, got me about three tablespoons of stevia. So you can see that when you get one of those big three pound bags, you're talking about an acre or more of stevia uh, that's going into that three bag, and I thought that you might be interested to know that. Thanks again.